Hey guys, we're Grubbers, and welcome back to my FIFA 16 a little pool promo where last time left off. I, he, he gave Lester quite a bad beat, and, and I picked up the win in the cup against Barnsley. It's a, it's a, or I have. Have a late game against Wolves as you can see. Hey, hey, and I will also have my a next group game in the Champions League, which I think is game four, and will be the game that wins me the group and guarantees my passage through to the uh, next round. I think I'm not sure on. The uh, win group, I think I'll have to look at the points before the game, but I think it will it'll definitely be the game where I guarantee the, uh, that I will progress to the next round. First thing first is Wolves. Here is the way Wolves are set out for this vital um, I'm sure a lot of you are probably the, uh, anticipating. Such a phrasing of uh, the match two nights ago between Liverpool and Burton. Now, Burton aren't the bad team. Marco Royce in the wide positions. Cristiano Ronaldo plays up front with Neymar. But, um,. That's the, that's the kind of match Liverpool should be winning, and thankfully this time they actually won the match that they were supposed to win, unlike what they did with Burnley. So, uh, yeah. Cristiano Ronaldo. The shot's up! Not much in that. It was a whisker wide of the post. I guess I would have probably been a bit pissed off if they had gone out of the cup. So I guess if we had to lose one of those matches, I guess Burnley is, you know, the, That's a good challenge between the two of them lesser of the two evils that could have been the case. So uh, I'm, I'm not going to talk about the Burton match too much. I do want to talk about Daniel Sturge scoring two goals. And while Burton really weren't, I mean, they seem to be there for the taking. I mean, they looked improved at the start of the second half, but they fell away. They did. They really did. And Liverpool just outplayed them in every department. Just, they, they dominated. They really did. They dominated. It was really... Something, uh, and it's gone for a corner. Liverpool dominates that match. So, uh, yeah. But, uh, I want to talk about Daniel Sturridge banging two goals. Um, I made no secret in the last episode that I thought that I had, um, I had my doubts about Daniel Sturridge following the Burnley game. Now, this obviously shows that Daniel Sturridge is so a great commodity, but I still think that he could, you know, the business over the last ten games, they've been unstoppable. He could uh, fetch us a pretty okay price and get someone else in, if need be. I mean, we really don't need to. I mean, Danny Ings, work for me, you know, Sayo Mane, he, Ivo Karigi, of course, depending on how bad he's hurt. It looked like it was only cramp. That's, that's what I'm hearing, is that Origi's was only cramp, so... Origi might be okay. I, I, I'm, I'm generally worried about Emery Chan. I think he... I think he fucked his leg up like... nobody's business. So, uh... Yeah. That, that's... That's gonna be an issue. Emery Chan... still... recovering from a... ankle injury. And 
hogs up, then out of nowhere, boom, he fucks up the play again. Well, that is a cheap piece of play to well, get the ball away like that. We took, we took the risk of, uh, of having him playing. I mean, maybe we should have brought him off sooner. Considering he got injured, I am really, he, I was really good. It, after he got injured, though, I was like, oh, if only he, he could have at least been awarded the goal boy. I mean, he was very unlucky that it went in off the uh, Burton player instead of him. And when it was showing Chan, I was like, oh, Chan scored. No. Someone you expect to score, I'll take it. Chelsea or Luton. I just need to do my part and actually take the lead here. Um, yeah, when I found out it was an own goal, I was like, oh. Especially, and I was really disappointed. Sad for uh, Emery, especially when he went off injury. So, yeah. He's uh, denied a goal, and he goes off injured. So, it was a bad night for Emery Chan. Considering how good a night it was for Liverpool overall, it was a very bad night for Emery Chan. He's pointed for the free kick. Coming up for you on EA Sports, the next Barclays Premier League fixture for the hosts. Royce. Marco Royce! He missed. Oh, for fuck's sake. As the move developed on that counter attack, and now they'll be reflecting on a genuine wasted chance. What is going on? Are they playing it around? They are fucking playing it around. Neymar! Yes! Oh, they fucked up! Up. Up. And the goal has come just... I want to say just past the hour mark. Yep, just past the hour mark, the 60 second minute. We we'll thought they were going to hold out for that no no draw. Ah, 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 not today. He, he defense minded. Hicks, you shouldn't have started playing it around the back. That was always going to lead to disaster. One or two players are warming up for the home team. We'll see who comes on. Real good contest between these two as they jostle for possession. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Wallace. Can't keep the ball in this match. For... I'm generally concerned that they are not keeping the ball as much as I'd like them to. Come on. Strength some at least two passes to get. And that will be a start. There we go. Oh. Now you're more. Our bag's a second. And Wolves' defensiveness can go screw itself. Now, even if they score a cheeky goal, it will only be a consolation. Of course, I'm waiting for that not to happen. Clear to the man's. It's going to go out off round to the man's. To the man's. I think Tino could both use with a, use a bit of a rest. I'm not sure why they're tired. And play it since that game against Leicester. 
Can't keep it on the pitch. It's gone out for a throw. Uh, move Marco Royce to Cam and play, bring on uh, Jordan Ive and Danilo. I was going to play a little further forward than you normally would, but uh, hey. Can do it. Counting down in the last ten minutes here. Nine to go. That. Yes. Neymar. Good. Boys can't keep the ball, of course. That's difficult. Wasteful pass. Unforced error, really. Ronaldo. Neymar. That'll be my worst display of uh, ball retention. I don't normally have. I mean, it it would be a rare game that I am ever the possession guy. I almost always have less possession than the computer, but it'll almost be 75, 25. If we, how many times my players gave it away? Look at that. Look at that possession domination. And like I said, it's because because my players couldn't keep her for for more than five seconds. It would string one pass and two passes max. At least Chelsea lost. They actually lost 2 0 no instead of 1 0. No. That's fantastic. That means Chelsea dropped three more points. That's two losses in a row for Chelsea. Because they lost in the last episode as well. They might not finish second if this run keeps up. <laughs> I, I won't be He's sorry to see him lose out in second for the first time in five goddamn seasons. Seriously, they've been second all four previous seasons. You can go back and check. I know this one. Before I do my local career, my Chelsea are always seem like the team that challenged me for some reason. I don't know why it's always Chelsea, but it seems to be always Chelsea. Oh yeah, Dragoski. He is uh, currently sidelined. Do I have an art keeper? Or does... It looks like my uh, main keeper will have to play the game. And I mean that as in he has to be in goal for the match and not face Triple H. <laughs> that's, that's not... What we're talking about. <laughs> Sorry if I act, act a little uh, weird. And I have this pain in my neck, and I. He took. gum, some. paracetamol to. Just, just to ease it and maybe get rid of it. So, um. Uh, I don't know if it's going to affect me as in make me tire or make me eat. Okay. Off in terms of uh, why I say and do, but hey. Whatever. Let's see. Uh, yeah, this win will get me... Will guarantee me... Will, um, will all but guarantee me top spot. It only won't if Zenit win and uh, are playing the team that are bottom of the group, so they might win. Of course, if P3 win, then I uh, comfortably won the, uh, I keep saying the league, because I'm thinking that's the Champions League. But no, just because you win your group doesn't mean you win the league, or else it'd be any out trophies to all the teams that win their group. That's not 
Okay, so you have to actually win the whole goddamn thing. So, into the game against Halo Warsaw. May as well follow the Zenit game, why not? I mean, I'm gonna be guaranteed qualification no matter what they do as long as I win, so, um, it's more of a to know if I have, have guaranteed. I'm more or less guaranteed. I mean, I'd have to lose both of my remaining games, and even though I'm simming them, I would like to think that the second team will be at least they will get a draw against PSV or Rosario. This is the Liverpool side. Well, it's 4 4 2 for them today, but we think the middle four. That is neither here nor there. There's still a bit of solidity in the middle of the park. Date. This is on the fullbacks to be Folks now is to beat. Warsaw. Huh? And to ooh, wrap up the group. The shot's on! Good play by the defenders, really, to force that error when it came to the shot. It's a long way wide. Yeah, he just lost his shape completely. And so. For someone. He could be the star turn for Liverpool today. He uh, really has enjoyed oh, Yeah, Aquilanti has been on fire since he moved from Chelsea. Maybe that's why they're losing. They're missing him. And there he goes again. He's still goal scorer in the competition. I would be surprised if he isn't, because I think that's like his fifth goal. Might be more. Maybe I shouldn't have skipped past. Maybe I should have tell you how many he has. Well, he'll. He might score again. Here he comes again. No, it's easier for me to give it to Wilson. Oh, so easy. I said it when I saw this group. This is probably the easiest group I've ever had. And I mean, it has no disrespect to the teams that are in it. It's just, they aren't exactly what you'd expect top last to be. I mean, there's, you know, like, like, the biggest named team would be, I mean, I don't know, who's a bigger named team? PSV or Zenit? Zenit are a Russian power. Has oops, but PSV have won the Eredivisie back to back, and Zenit have won the Russian. Well, I don't know if they've been winning the Russian League. I think I don't really follow the Russian League. I mean, they have to finish somewhere in the Champions League spots. And the, Russian League to get into the competition in the first place, obviously. Hmm. Defenders caught out by it in the end. Anyway, Aquilanti has made it three. I will show you how many goals he has now in this competition. Eventually. There we go. Eight! So that first goal was his seventh of the competition, that's eight. We are four games in. Well, this is delightful for Yep, that tells you all you need to know about how good he has been so far. Chelsea must be absolutely kicking themselves that they didn't at least try to get more from him. And I signed him on really late in the transfer window, oh, on deadline day. And I didn't give Chelsea a hell of a lot of time to uh, bring in a replacement. It's be a throw in after that tackle. I mean, it's hard to replace someone who scores those goals. It is. I mean, um, it'd be very hard to find someone who will, will fill the gap in terms of the goals that some. I mean. I can actually use Liverpool, for example. I mean, we still haven't replaced someone. We don't. We still haven't gotten someone into fill the 
lack of goals that Suarez, that we lost when we sold Suarez. Now, while it's... It looks good that we've scored so far nine goals. We've also conceded six. Weak challenge. Well, the slight tackle came in, but he's hurdled it. Good take by the goalkeeper, but no pressure on him. Eight, six, no, five. Sorry, my bad. Five. Burnley only scored two against us, not three. I don't know why I thought they scored third. Also, Burnley can go absolutely fucking themselves because. They beat Liverpool, and then what do they do in the cup? Oh, they go and lose to Accrington Stanley. Who are they? Exactly. Yes, I made that joke. Why not? But seriously, how did they lose? Who's a game they probably should have won. And I was pissed off. I wouldn't have been too mad if it was in in the penalty shootout, but they lost. Some in regular, well, not in regulation time, they lost an extra time, but they still lost. Just wondered about the they lost in open play. Why well, I guess I'm trying to say, because Eklund, he scores his ninth for the competition and completes his hat trick. Well, no wonder he's wheeling away. I mean, super celebration. To get a hat trick. Liga have just been. Lurka, or however you say their name, can be just been second best. And the exact game is 1 1. Fantastic. That means I would win the group. Fantastic. Thank you. The PS3. He could you hold that as well. Or maybe score. Or, or goal yourself. Come on. Or, or laugh. Why not? It's going to be an interesting matchup this one. that well in midfield to get them on the ball. Wilson. He's one possession. Oh! Boom! The keeper almost ran the ball into the net himself. What the hell was he doing? One man had one half like he's had. Everything that fell his way, he took and uh, he'll be after more after the break, I'm sure, but what a hat-trick. I see a substitute coming on for the away team here. No. Come on, Ojo. Damn it. And he gets it returned to him. Claims the cross. It was well. It's nothing Seriously, that's that's the extent of what my keeper has had to do. Uh, I was making a big fuss about having to put him in. Fixture for Liverpool. I get you know, let's have a bad defensive day. Hey, my keeper normally doesn't do much anyway. Normally, I'm defensively solid unless I make a huge error. Or I get fucked over by the game. Because both those have happened in the past, and no doubt they will happen again in the future on this and future FIFAs. This, i.e., the one coming out in a few weeks. Now I'll wait to get my hands on the new FIFA. Past his man. I'm a little disappointed that they haven't changed too much about career mode. I mean, they've added avatars and real life managers. You know, you can't customize the fucking avatar, so I'll have to fucking look like Jurgen fucking Klopp. Even though I'm not Jurgen fucking Klopp. 
Dr. Jurgen Klopp is Jurgen Klopp. I am myself. I am my own person. It's annoying. Why can't we customize it? Hey, we want our managers to look like us. The whole point of career mode is the point that you take over the team. That you are in control. Not someone else. You make the decisions. You... And the avatar at the side should be you. Grant, I... It'll be interesting to see how that affects, like, the, uh, celebration at the end, because it's really piss poor that you generic guys over there. I mean, seriously. No matter what I set my guy to look like, my guy is supposed to look heck, oh, oh, and... Stuff like that. Look at that. He's bald. Oh. Oh. Is any butt pale? I mean, maybe it's the lighting, but. And the other thing is, you can't tell which is which. Bitch. Possession in the midfield area. Seriously. Me and the, the guy they put in charge of Liga are the same guy. And every manager ends up bald. Why are they bald? Bald. That's okay. That's cool if you're bald. Bald. Oh, but I'm not bald. I have hair. I would like if my manager looked more like me. Expand on what you are giving us. I mean, by all means, have the real life managers in the game, but have a, the option to customize your own manager. Or, or so you can put yourself in the game. And when I play career my next see FIFA, I should have I shouldn't have to sell for looking like some other manager. I should my avatar should look like me. It should be a pale white six one Irish guy with black hair. Done. That's all we want. We want our managers to look like us. We don't want to take over the life. We don't want. I mean, I. Well, I'm happy with the job that he is doing at Liverpool. Oh, excuse me. I don't want to be Jurgen Klopp. I don't want to take over his life. I don't have any inspiration to be to take over Jurgen Klopp's life. So, um, yeah. Anyway. Next episode, uh, we'll play. the team ironically Liverpool have at the weekend, which is Spurs, and I'll have a huge game against Chelsea, where I can expand my lead to 13 points, because it's already 10 points, and I have yet to play Chelsea once, because they keep fucking up. <laughs> so... Yeah. Don't miss the next episode. Uh, would hit the like button if you enjoyed this episode. Put subscribe if you're new to it. Well, we'll see. Don't miss it. Give my he he up and coming videos and make sure you check out the past videos that I posted to this channel. Well, they're all top quality. If I do say so myself. So yeah, thanks for watching, I'm enjoying it, and until next time, I hope you all have a very, very nice day. Peace!